guys, today is Sunday, and tomorrow I leave to Cusco, then Puerto Maldonado, and then Rio Branco. Rio Branco is Brazil. Right now, I'm on hold for a bus company because I want to ask them if they take uh, credit cards because uh, I forgot about that. I'm gonna pay with a credit card, so I gotta make sure they accept that. Um, tomorrow we leave like around 1, 2 or 3 p.m. It's kind of weird schedule, but they leave at 1, 2 or 3 p.m. So I'll have a morning available. Yo, I, I won't be on a rush. And today is uh, Sunday, which is Mother's Day in most countries. <laughs> uh, it's Mother's Day and I wanna say Happy Mother's Day to anyone out there. If you're watching this and it's your mom, happy Mother's Day. I also want to say uh, happy Mother's Day to my mom. Uh, I want to give her a shout out to my mom and say congratulations on your day. My couch are for Claudia and Diego. I'm pretty sure they're with their families right now celebrating Mother's Day. I hope so. Uh, I think that's where they are and I might see them later tonight. I don't know, hold for it. I don't think they're gonna ask, but um. All right, guys, so we begin the trip again. Um, I'm leaving Lima right now, and I'm going to Brazil. Should be there in 38 hours. It's gonna be a long ride, man. It's gonna be three buses, 36, 38 hours, or even more. I don't know. All right, guys, so I'm leaving Lima, and uh, I really think this city was pretty cool, man. It's very well developed. A lot of people don't think that way, they think that Lima is really bad, but actually it's a very nice city. And I will definitely come back if I have a chance in the future. Of course I have to come back. I, there was a lot of things that I didn't do that I would like to do, like Machu Picchu, I'm not gonna do it. So it's a big country, so I mean, even if you came here just for like, to visit the country, it will be really hard to hit every spot. And I've seen some pictures and they've told me about some places that are pretty awesome that are not even, you know, like touristy. So yeah, in the future I see myself coming back here, for sure. Now let me tell you guys how this is gonna work out. I'm gonna take a bus from here to the, to the bus station. Every single brand of buses has their own stations. Now the other thing is that after that, I'm gonna take the ride to Cusco. And then from Cusco I have to take another bus to Puerto Maldonado. Once I get to Puerto Maldonado, I have to take another bus to the border and then from the border to Rio Branco. So that's why it's gonna take like 38 hours. Check it out guys, this is the bus station I'm taking. Well, the bus company, I'm gonna take the bus to uh, Cusco. It's called Mobile Tours, but like I said before, there's a bunch of companies that will take you over there. And they're all around this area that is like right next to the stadium the Estadio Nacional, National Stadium, which is really nice, especially right now when it's sunny. But all the bus stations are along this street. There's like probably eight to 10 bus stations around here. They're all along the street and behind the street. and then they're like, this is like the, I guess it will be like the business class. It wasn't that bad, it was only like, I think it was only 20 or 30 soles more, which I really think is worth it for 24 hours of, of, a, of a ride. they actually serve you a meal here too. Mm -hmm. 